Do you live in a small apartment? If so, then you more than likely understand the problems that come with not having a lot of room to store things. Instead of getting rid of almost everything you own, just consider using some of these cool ideas. They'll help you get organized in a jiffy, and you won't have to do anything too crazy, like put a dumpster under your window to pitch things into. Welcome to Jensen's DIY, and in this video, we will discuss 25 super brilliant ideas to add space in a small apartment. 1. While you do have to be careful about putting holes in the walls, there's nothing wrong with putting up a small shelf. It doesn't require a lot of supports, just one on either end, and it will give you plenty of storage space. This shelf can hold everything from utensils to mugs, freeing up a bunch of cabinet space. The more storage that you have, the better. 2. A storage ladder is exactly what it sounds like. It's a ladder with extra wide steps designed to hold a number of different things. Many people use them for plants, but they can also hold everything from shoes to storage crates filled with random items, whatever you feel like putting on there. There really is no shortage of uses, and have we mentioned that you can move it around? 3. If space is truly an issue, then this shelf table will work nicely. You'll need a short bookcase, a tabletop, two legs for the other end of the table, and several tall stools to sit on. Just make sure that they are a comfortable height and you're good to go. The shelves can hold your clean dishes, which makes setting the table super easy. 4. Some apartments just don't have an under-the-sink cabinet, or if they do, it isn't large enough to hold all of your toiletries. That's where this metal storage unit comes into play. It sits on the countertop and provides space for things like soap and extra toothbrushes. When you need to access it, everything will be literally right at your fingertips. 5. The area next to the stove is the perfect spot for a shallow bookcase. Place one there and use it to hold things like cookbooks, cooking utensils, and everything in between. You can even put spices on it, or an entire spice rack. Just keep in mind that anything there will get splattered while you cook. 6. There's no shortage of things that you can do with a cabinet when you have a proper organizer in place. This metal one consists of two shelves, and it pulls out, giving you easy access to everything in the back, those items that would normally end up lost at the back. Just imagine how many things you can fit there with this useful tool. 7. Usually small apartments don't come with a pantry. That's a special closet only installed in larger spaces. Thankfully, you can make your own. All you need is a glass-fronted cabinet that's small enough to fit into a corner of the kitchen or dining room. Fill it with canned goods, use nice glass jars, or do whatever you need to do to make it look nice and organized at the same time. 8. These small ceramic shelves certainly save the day. They work in lieu of a traditional bathroom medicine cabinet and can hold quite a few of your toiletries. Even better, since you're installing the shelves on your own, if you need more, you can just hang them, as long as there's space on the wall. Add in a mirror that folds into the wall, and your bathroom will be set. 9. Open shelving is a brilliant idea. When you have a tiny apartment, especially a studio one where everything fits into a single room, these shelves can hold important items and serve as a space divider. Since the shelves are open on both sides, you can put things for one room on one side and items for the other, well, on the other end. 10. If you lack the space needed for a proper nightstand, don't despair. You actually have options, including this shelf hack. Find a shelf that's just big enough to hold a lamp and an alarm clock and hang it next to your bed. If you need to, you can fit it over the bed as well. You just need enough room for those essentials, and as long as you can reach them, everything will work out. 11. There's no rule that bookcases need to be huge. A small one that's the same height as your sofa arm fits nicely up against it. Stash baskets on the shelves and then place things in them. They can hold magazines, chargers, electronic devices, and other knickknacks. And since the shelf fits right up against the side of the couch, you won't trip over it. 12. You don't need to keep your kitchen utensils on your counter. Instead, free up that space and use it for cooking preparations. Hang those utensils and other things on the wall. 
Install some metal bars and hang cups on them. Put your kitchen items in the cups or attach to S-hooks on the bars. This helps you make use of otherwise wasted wall space. 13. As long as you don't have too many spices, this small shelf will work wonders. Some of those spices fit on the shelf, others fit under it. All that matters is that everything is properly contained and easy to reach when you need it. If you need extra space on your counter, consider placing this tiny shelf in a corner that would otherwise go unused. 14. If you seriously lack prep space in your kitchen, then you'll love this idea. You can use your existing counters to hold all of your items while using this foldable space for things like chopping and meal prep. The counter is a slab of wood that matches your existing ones. However, on its hinges, so it folds up when you need it and down to get it out of the way. Check out the DIY guide on Live from Julie's House. 15. This method works best if you lack closet space, or if your apartment is particularly old, you don't have any closet space at all. Just hang some closet rods, two of them, one on top of the other on the bottom, on a wall instead of some shelves at the top. Now you have a huge space to work with and can properly organize all of your clothing without having to deal with those things that get lost in the closet corners. 16. Wicker baskets with lids look great at the foot of a bed and they provide some handy storage space. You can even move the baskets around when needed and if it's sturdy enough, it can double as a bench. Sometimes the best storage is right out in the open. 17. Some apartments have awkward corners where two walls meet. You can't really put anything there other than a broom or some shoes, making them useless spaces, until you install some shelves that are. Cut the wood down to the right size and hang those shelves up. Now you have space for all your knickknacks. If you put it next to the door, use those shelves to hold your keys, purse, and more. 18. Hidden storage paintings are pieces of artwork that have been mounted over storage boxes. No one will know what's back there unless you tell them. These boxes are fairly narrow and have the best place to put your sewing kit, crafting items, or even extra chargers. When you need to get what you have stashed there, just remove the picture to expose the storage area. 19. Even small apartment dwellers can have plenty of plants. You just need to put them in the right spaces, like on the wall. Hang up some metal shelves with hardware that will support your plants and go from there. The plants that don't fit can be hung traditionally from the ceiling on a hook. The whole idea is to get the plants out of the way. 20. If you're afraid that a traditional shelving unit won't be large enough for all your things, then get one of these spinning ones. They literally spin around like racks at a comic book shop and have enough space to hold plenty of different items. They double your space since you can use every side and their spinning motion is very fun to watch. Check out the DIY guide on her tool belt. 21. When you have towels that you use every day but a lack of places to hang them, don't put them on the wall. You need that space for shelves and other things. Instead, put those towels on the back of the bathroom door. Just attach the hangers or towel bars with some appropriate hardware and put up enough for all your everyday towels. 22. You can fit a lot more items into a small space with the help of stacking plastic bins and wicker baskets. Just fill them with your things, neatly of course, and then stack them up. They're an inexpensive alternative to putting in cabinet shelves to divide up the space. You'd be surprised at how much more you can store in that same space. 23. Sometimes a small apartment isn't large enough for a reasonably sized desk. Instead, you'll have to choose a very small one and hang what you can on the walls around it. Things like clipboard can be placed on hooks, your pen and pencil cups can go on the walls, and you can stash as many things as possible under the desk. Just make sure that you have enough space for your legs. 24. Believe it or not, if you choose the right shelving units, you can line the walls with them and the space won't feel cramped at all. Instead, they'll blend right in and look as though they've always been there. The more shelves that you have, the better, since they provide you with plenty of space to stash all of your stuff. 25. 
There's probably room above your kitchen cabinets, that space between them and the ceiling that's going to waste. Make sure you use it. Put some shelves up there if the space is big enough and store seldom used kitchen items on them. The less space you waste, the better. And that's all for now. What do you think about this episode? Please share your thoughts about this video in the comment section. For more kitchen storage and organization ideas, stay tuned to our channel. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.